Welcome back to more Mass Effect. I'm Negative Zero. Thank you for watching. I hope you're doing all right. Well, let's actually let's put our guns away. We're not going to need them here. We're in the ambassador's room. He's left us right by his computer. Let's see if we can decrypt it. Oh, we can use the Omni Gel. Right. Let's see if we can do the override first. It should be an easy one. We're going to go right here. And we got it. Alliance Patrol report. Captain Hendrickson reported some unusual energy readings during a patrol of the Argos Row cluster. She had particular concerns about the Hydra system, but was recalled before her team could investigate further. No patrols are scheduled for that sector. Do you want to send in a recon team? And I think that gives us an assignment in the journal. Yeah, Hydra system Argos Row. Right, that's how we get our side missions. It's by hacking everything. Let's see what we've got. Shield battery for the armor oh you know what we've got something for tally let's see how does it look it's got way more shields which i think is what we want we're not really worried about the biotic protection just yet and it looks pretty cool actually looks really cool garris there's something for him as well is it better it's got higher shields but less everything else hmm Hmm, I don't know. What's it look like? It looks okay. Yeah, let's use it. And he's a... Assault Rifle guy, so we're gonna give him this. Tally, I believe, is a pistol. I don't even know. You know what? Let's see what she looks like as far as her skills. Oh, and we've got some points as well. We unlocked basic armor, so let's put one on there. And then I think... We got to get to the higher overload, but we want to get to the hacking as well. Hmm. Or do we want to put one more on charm? Let's do it. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Tally. Tally, where are you? 12 points. So can we get her to shotguns? We're not really going to use her a lot. Let's give her basic armor. Horian Machinist. Shield, massive shield capacity. Wow, that's super useful. Um, which one of these? Which one of these is better? Let's get her, I think she can get to both. Advanced, yep. And this is kind of where we want to be. In fact, we'll be working towards this as we level up. And then maybe this? Sure. Oh, I didn't. We're going to need pistols for her. And Garrus. I always... I don't know why I keep backing out of it. Mm. Turian agent. Sniper rifle? Yeah, we want to get to that. So we need to get to... The, the council. And talk to them. But first we're going to talk to this guy. Zeltan. Strained greeting, human. This is really not a good time. I can help you, man. I know who revealed your secret. It was a Turian named Septimus. Unbelieving. I know this Septimus, and he could not learn my secrets. The only way he could learn them is from the Asari consort. Here. There should be proof enough for you. Confused. This is difficult to fathom. If the Turian could learn this on his own, dismayed, anyone can discover my secret. Don't worry, it'll be all right. The Septimus is a powerful man, and it wasn't easy for him to find. Relieved. I suppose you are correct, human. Thank you for this information. Startled realization. I must speak with the consort. She will be most displeased with my actions. Anxious request. Please, human, if you will excuse me, I must go now. I'm sure she'll forgive you. It was an honest mistake. Doubtful. Perhaps you are right, human. I can only hope so. Thankful. That was a great thing you did, Commander. Approving. You see, Din, not all humans are as you say. 
I'm sure the Earth Clan stands to profit from this in some way. So let's go ahead and scan this keeper. Oh, they're still talking. Oh, I thought he left. <laughs> so let's do a quick run around. There weren't any keepers in the ambassador's room. That's not a real room, right? Let's look at the map. Yeah, there might be some stuff here. We haven't been to... Oh, we haven't been here at all. We need to get over to the consort. Oh, there's this guy. He's Excuse gonna... Excuse me, Commander Shepard. Could you spare a moment of your time? Sure. Commander Shepard, my name is Samesh Patia. Forgive the intrusion, but I have nowhere else to turn. What do you need? My wife was a Marine. She was in the 212 on Eden Prime. I've requested that my wife's body be returned to me for cremation, but the military has refused my request. Why did they refuse your request? There's got to be some reason. I don't know. All I know is that they have declared it impossible for my wife to be returned to me. Okay, we, we could possibly help this guy. It's We're not going to be totally rude about it, but we'll, you know, there might be more to the story, so we'll, we'll just be neutral about the it. man in charge of my case is Mr. Bosker. When I last saw him, he was in the expensive bar over there. <laughs> the Thank expensive you the bar. I just want to give my wife a proper funeral and the respect she deserves. So he's over here. And we're going to go look around in here anyway. What, what are you doing, Garrus? And if I'm... Yeah, there's totally a keeper right over here. We are just making... I mean, it's a fair bit of... Well, Codex. We're making a fair bit of money off of this keeper thing. And here is, I believe this is CSAC. Oh no, no, that's <laughs> Garrus. What are you doing, man? This is CSAC. Uh, don't mind me, I'm just looking for keepers. Oh, there's something over here. Can I, are you gonna mind if I hack this? Diplomatic advisory warning. The following message was transmitted from an untraceable account to multiple recipients across the extranet. Further monitoring of the situation is warranted. My fellow biotic, you have been selected to receive this transmission because of our shared plight. Few understand us, fewer tolerate us. We must stand together. We must build our own new world. Come join us in the Hawking Eta. Eta? Cluster? Only as one body can we right the wrongs done to our kind. So there's some sort of biotic uprising going on. And nothing there. I feel like maybe, yeah, maybe in the bar. But let's talk to this guy. Executor Palin. Commander Shepard, I didn't Palin. expect to see you here. Did Ambassador Udina send you? No. I came on my own. I need information. You humans are always so curious. Always sticking your fingers into someone else's pie. Is that the right expression? Uh, never mind. Forget I asked. Was there something you needed, Commander? Oh, maybe we needed to talk to him instead of going to Harkin. Tell me about your investigation into Saren. Sorry, Commander. I don't make a habit of giving out details about ongoing investigations. Fair enough. Tell me about CSEC. CSEC provides necessary police and security services throughout the Citadel. We're a civilian government agency, though many of our members have had military training. Of course, as the CSEC representative to the council, I spend most of my time liaising between the two. Fair enough. I I don't think I think we're fine. I'll be going now. Goodbye. Commander. Oh, we did get, I guess, some codex codex stuff out of him. So we leveled up. Now let's see what we can do. What did I say I wanted? I wanted to get to advanced sabotage, and I need to get my electronic. Are we only getting two a level? We are. For you, what do you want? What do I need for you? Assault training? Maybe. We don't really need him for the decryption, right? Hmm. 
tactical armor, Morturian agent, maybe. Yeah, one more there. I mean, it goes up 3% every time. You know what? Let's undo it. Let's get him to unlock assault training so we can put something in that next time. Look at this. Look at the melee damage. Up 30%. Tally. Pistols. Do, do we want even more? We can get her to unlock hacking. This is fine. Yet, yeah, return to the tower, and yet, yeah, the commune we just saw. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, we have to go see the guy in the bar. Right, right, right. He's just hanging out. My goodness, you're Commander Shepard. Your activities made for quite a briefing in the diplomatic corps. Is there something I can do to assist you? Yeah, let's talk about this guy. Yes. A man named Samesh Batya is having some trouble claiming his wife's body. Ah, Mr. Batya. A good man in an understandably frustrating position. I wish I could help him. Serviceman Nirali Batya died on Eden Prime, as Mr. Batya no doubt told you. Her wounds are inconsistent with any type of weapon damage we've seen before. That is why her body is being held. You're studying her injuries to learn more about Geth weaponry. The tests we're conducting may lead to better defenses against Geth attacks. Respectfully, Serviceman Batia may save more lives in death than she did in life. Hmm. I mean, I think that's important. I, I'm not going to say this. It's not right. It's totally right. How long do you think the research is going to take? This is a long-term study. I wouldn't expect the bodies to be released for a year or longer. You've got to have a lot of bodies. Can't you release one? Very few bodies had this new type of weapon damage, and very few were in good enough condition to study. Beyond that, Commander, we need as many bodies as we can to get a reasonable sample size. When will this research result in actual new technology? If we're lucky, we'll actually realize usable technology from this study in a few years. I'll tell Samesh. Next time you come to get soldier, at least tell her husband the truth. <laughs> that was just the reaction we were hoping to avoid, Commander. But if you think it will help, tell Mr. Batia the truth. Perhaps he will understand. Please let I, me know. If I really, questions. I mean, I know the upper ones are the Paragon ones and the lower ones are the Renegade ones. I really did not intend that to, uh, <laughs> to be so harsh. I think if we go out here, there's a, yeah, there's a keeper. Right? How many do we have? And is this even worth it? 13 of 21. We're like halfway there. Where the rest of them are? I don't know. Bartender. Hello, Commander. Can I get you something? Yeah. What have you got? Information, mostly. Would you like to know about some points of interest nearby? Oh. Tell me. What's going on around here? Well, you found the embassies. Not much going on here. Across the bridge, you'll find the bank, the Emporium, and Shaira's. If you haven't heard of her, you soon will. If you need supplies, you can try the markets one level below. For entertainment, I'd try Flux or Cora's Den. All right, that's fine. We know, we know where all this stuff is. We haven't been to Flux, though. I think maybe that's so the long, casino. I don't have time to talk now. I'm very busy. Yes, yes. There are... Don't believe the rumors. The consort would never reveal her secrets. What do you want? Oh, Commander. Is there something I can do for you? What can you tell me about the Asari consort? I, uh... Well, she's an Asari who works here as... That is, she helps people with... Things. You never went to see her, did you? I, uh... No, I never did. Uh, I couldn't afford it. It costs half a year's credits just to go in and talk to her. Yeah. That's fine, Private. Just tell me where to find her. Sure. She's across the bridge from the embassies. Yeah, we actually know this. He's... 
we didn't really need that information. Oh, there's someone right here too. The diplomat. This place seems strange. Wish there were more humans around. Hmm. So let's talk to this guy. He's not going to be happy about this. I don't know if we're charming enough to to make this work out well. Hello, Commander. Has any progress been made with Mr. Bosker? Will he return my wife's body? It's not as simple as I'd hoped. The military needs your wife's body for important tests. Tests? They're holding my wife's body for tests? My wife served the Alliance faithfully. She gave her life for humanity. And this is yeah. how they repay her. Um, yeah, I'm not charming enough. Unfortunately. It's unacceptable. I'll let you know what I can do. Thank you. Please let me know what can be done. Nothing. Nothing. I just need to improve my charm. Let's... Can I just fast travel over there? How long does this take? Not long at all. So I think we're, yeah, we're ready to go talk to her. That's right. it was a long time ago, though. I barely we handled the Septimus thing? Yeah. So I, I noticed that Tally's new armor, we can't see her, her face. Tally, why are you turning around? Tally! <laughs> Dang it. Get off the couch. Commander, I recently received a lovely note from Septimus. Thank you for speaking with him. Even the Alcor diplomat has withdrawn his campaign against me. No problem. It was it's good to have to a person you. like you You're owe me a favor. Commander, but I would not expect you to help me out of the kindness of your heart. I also have one more thing to give you, if you are interested. Sure, I'd be honored. I offer a gift of words, an affirmation of who you are and who you will become. I see the sadness behind your eyes. It tells a story that makes me want to weep. Pain and loss, but it drives you, makes you strong. That strength is what kept you alive when everyone around you was dying. You alone survived. You will continue to survive. This may be who you are, but it is not who you will become. It only forms the basis for your future greatness. Remember these words when doubt descends, Commander. You have quite a gift, Cheira. Thank you. Not everyone appreciates it as you do. Never underestimate the power of words. Here, Commander. In light of your efforts with the Elcor Ambassador, I would like you to have this small trinket. Um, uh, thanks. What is it? A small mystery. I have never learned its use or purpose, but I sense it is time for me to pass it on. And now I must ask you to leave. I have done everything I can for you. Remember so, my words, Commander Shepard. They will give you strength. What did she give us? Do we know? Rewarded, rewarded to show <laughs> her gratitude. The concert rewarded you with an oddly shaped trinket. It appears to be a Prothean design, but doesn't seem to have any purpose beyond sentimental value. I don't remember that. I don't know what that is. If you know what that is, let me know. Does it come into play later? Okay, I think that's everything. Let's get out of here. Whoa, whoa, that's a little... Is there anything else? There was no keeper in there. Where the heck are the rest of them? Oh, we haven't been to everywhere in the wards let's go ahead and get this thing in the tower handled oh you know what we haven't done a lot of the lower tower part where csec is we haven't searched everywhere there but let's deal with this first is it behind us yeah i think so come on udina's presenting the quarian's evidence to the council 
Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. You wanted proof? There it is. This evidence is irrefutable, Ambassador. Saren will be stripped of his Spectre status, and all efforts will be made to bring him in to answer for his crimes. I recognize the other voice, the one speaking with Saren. Matriarch Benezia. Who's she? Matriarchs are powerful Asari who have entered the final stage of their lives. Revered for their wisdom and experience, they serve as guides and mentors to my people. Matriarch Benezia is a powerful biotic, and she had many followers. She will make a formidable ally for Saren. I'm more interested in the Reapers. What do you know about them? Only what was extracted from the Geth's memory core. The Reapers were an ancient race of machines that wiped out the Protheans. Then they vanished. Hmm. The Geth revere them, Saren's bringing them back. Do we know that for sure? At this point. We just had our confused our confusing vision. So we do definitely know this. Or this. These are all interesting things to say. But we don't want to say this one because it's a little bit too It's speculation. And this is speculation too. We do know that the Geth the Geth revere them. The Geth through believe the Reapers are gods, and Saren is the prophet for their return. We think the conduit is the key to bringing them back. Saren's searching for it. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Do we even know what this conduit is? It's trouble. Um, not yet. Saren thinks it can bring back the Reapers. That's bad enough. Listen to what you're saying. Saren wants to bring back the machines that wiped out all life in the galaxy? Impossible. It has to be. Where did the Reapers go? Why did they vanish? How come we found no trace of their existence? If they were real, we'd have found something. Yeah, um... All good questions, but they really are real. I tried to warn you about Saren, and you refused to face the truth. Don't make the same mistake again. This is different. You proved Saren betrayed the Council. We all agree he's using the Geth to search for the Conduit, but we don't really know why. The Reapers are obviously just a myth, Commander. A convenient lie to cover Saren's true purpose. A legend he is using to bend the Geth to his will. I disagree. 50,000 years ago, the Reapers wiped out all galactic civilization. If Saren finds the conduit, it will happen again. Saren is a rogue agent on the run for his life. He no longer has the rights or resources of a Spectre. The Council has stripped him of his position. That is not good enough. You know he's hiding somewhere in the Traverse. Send your fleet in! A fleet cannot track down one man. A citadel fleet could secure the entire region, keep the Geth from attacking any more of our colonies. Or it could trigger a war with the Terminus systems. We won't be dragged into a galactic confrontation over a few dozen human colonies. So, the Terminus systems are obviously not in Citadel space. Who runs the Terminus systems? Is that just like where the Geth are hanging out? I, I might need to look that up. But anyway... You need some help? Send me. I can take Saren down. The commander's right. There is a way to stop Saren that doesn't require fleets or armies. No. It's too soon. Humanity is not ready for the responsibilities that come with joining the Spectres. You don't have to send a fleet into the Traverse, and the Ambassador gets his human Spectre. Everybody's happy. Commander Shepard, step forward. It is the decision of the Council that you be granted all the powers and privileges of the Special Tactics and Reconnaissance Branch of the Citadel. Spectres are not trained, but chosen. Individuals forged in the fire of service and battle. Those whose actions elevate them above the rank and file. Spectres are an ideal, a symbol, 
the embodiment of courage, determination, and self-reliance. They are the right hand of the Council, instruments of our will. The Spectres bear a great burden. They are protectors of galactic peace, both our first and last line of defense. The safety of the galaxy is theirs to uphold. You are the first human Spectre, Commander. This is a great accomplishment for you and your entire species. What's my first mission? We're sending you into the Traverse after Seren. He's a fugitive from justice, so you are authorized to use any means necessary to apprehend or eliminate him. Any idea where to find him? We will forward any relevant files to Ambassador Udina. This meeting of the Council is adjourned. Congratulations, Commander. We've got a lot of work to do, Shepard. You're going to need a ship, a crew, supplies. You'll get access to special equipment and training now. You should go down to the CSEC Academy and speak to the Spectre Requisitions Officer. Anderson, come with me. I'll need your help to set all this up. I thought the Ambassador would be a little more grateful. He didn't even thank you. He's got a lot on his mind. Come on, right behind you, Shepard. Spectre training, charm, and intimidate talents unlocked. Let's take a look. Did we, we leveled up again? Yeah, we, we're only getting two now. And maybe after a certain level, we'll only get one point. So I need to start getting into the things I really like. What does this do? Store discount. Charm score at four. We definitely want that to be better. Oh, maybe we got a bonus to this. Let's look at Spectre training. Health by 5%, accuracy by 2, damage and duration by 1, regenerates accuracy per second. Unity restores dead squad members. That's going to be important. But we really need to start unlocking these electronics things because I want to have... Like, I want to have Rex in the party because he has a little bit of biotic stuff and he's part soldier. But I think maybe the other main will be Liara because of her biotics. We don't need Tally in the group. Garrus is great. And maybe we'll go with Garrus instead of Liara. I, I don't know. I don't know. But I'm thinking like we want to get all of this done well. So maybe the next two points will go straight into here. Do we need this yet? 5% health. We've got 148 health. So that'll be like 7 or 8 more points. Which is not bad. But we really need to get this done. Shield capacity. Oh yeah. Oh, what what have I been doing? 400. Oh, that's for the Mako. Yeah, let's, let's get it in here. Shield capacity by 60. 600 extra points. So advanced overload. Yeah, it's it's like twice as good. Ugh, I always I always forget to do the other people. Hmm. Let's get assassination. More tactical armor. Equip medium armor. Oh. I like that. I like that. And then shield boost. Maybe we go up to here. Tally, I'm not really sure. Let's put a point into this to unlock hacking and then a point in hacking. Very nice. So anything on the Citadel? I, I have a higher charm. So maybe we go back and talk to him. Oh, we need to go talk to this lady. Where is she? In the upper wards. Oh, maybe we're, where we left her. Nothing there. More scanning keepers. I think we're good. So let's go back to the... Are there... Is there a keeper up on this bit? Have we already gotten this guy? I can't remember. Got him. And then we have to do we have to do a quick run around on the other side. I think we can finally talk to Kahoku 
downstairs now that we've gotten past this point. He should be right here. No, I'm waiting to speak with one of the Council's assistants. Congratulations on becoming the first human specter, Commander. I'm certain you'll be up to the challenge. Thank you. I appreciate that. My name is Admiral Kahoku. It's about time the Alliance got one of our own in with the Spectres. We need people like you to deal with our problems. What do you mean? Is something wrong, Admiral? I'm getting stonewalled by bureaucratic assholes. <laughs> Nothing new. Maybe you can help me, Shepard. One of my recon teams was investigating some strange activity out in the Traverse. We lost contact yesterday. Now I can't get clearance to check it out. Suddenly it's a restricted area. But that doesn't apply to you, Shepard. Spectres can go anywhere they want. You could find out why my team dropped out of contact. Yeah, maybe I will. I'll find them, Admiral. I appreciate that, Commander. I was running out of options. I'm going to stay here and see if I can find anything out through official channels. Won't hold my breath, though. So basically, we're going to start doing favors for majorly important people. Yeah, we already got that guy. We've... No. I just want to ask a couple of questions. Uh, let's see. We've tried to create organic environments back on the flotilla, but we lack the space for anything as grand as this. Not too many people have free access to the tower. Even less get permission to meet the council. Yeah, we're, we're pretty special. I think this, however, is a great spot. <laughs> Look at him. He's just standing there. I think it's a great spot to take a break. We'll head to the wards and deal with a few of these missions before we wrap up the Citadel and get out into space. But I want to thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed our time together. Take care.